a change to a more democratic People's National Movement. According to Prime Minister and political leader of the PNM, Dr. Keith Rowley, he believed the party a bit better than he found it. But one of the things that I can be credited for is dismantling the delegate system where about 800 people across the country had the authority to vote to choose the PNM leader. We spent two years consulting on that in our party. We had ideas as to how it should be done, but we gave the party members an involvement in the process. Dr. Rowley added, while party members were not eager at first, by the time it came to a vote, there were few dissenting voices. Then we went to a special convention and voted to eliminate the delegate system. You don't have anybody voting for you. Come and vote for yourself. One man, one vote. Today that is standard in the PNM. Another change, he said, was the length of time an elected political leader will serve in office before re-election. Under his tenure, it was changed from five to four years. The political leader had a total control of the screening committee in our party and had a screening committee to assist the political leader under my leadership. We changed that and gave the screening committee members a vote in their own right in the PNM. Screening committee members no longer vote to assist the political leader. They vote in their own right, yea or nay, to select PNM candidates. Dr. Rowley made his remarks as he addressed the political meeting in Separi on Tuesday. The party has been campaigning across the country for the August 14th local government elections. Terry Ann Brown Campbell, DTT News.